See, it's Mark. I'm out here at 299 Apache Ridge. Um, pretty little koi pond here. So it, it takes, it's about a three mile ride, ride on a dirt road coming into, um, coming into this property. It's almost near the end of Apache Ridge Trail. And uh, so it's pretty darn far, but it's a, it's a nice road. Um, it's not bad at all. So you've got pretty expansive views. Get your septic out here. Pretty expansive views of the Pecos wilderness from this back porch area. This leads into the living room here. Dining area, kitchen, etc. And there's a door right off the kitchen as well. Masters up top there. And um, but it's pretty. I mean it's it's a little windy today and it's a hot day here. It's 86 here, which I know is pretty good for you. As far as terrain goes, it's pretty steep drop off uh, um, to the north here. Um, so n this land is not particularly usable on the north side. I have yet to discover the barn, quote unquote barn and arena. Um, so I'm gonna break this video into two segments. One that's the main house and one that is uh, the horse property. This is a front entry. It's got a great feel as an adobe. I mean, it feels like an adobe, right? Nice and cool. Very high Latia ceiling. Brick floors. Got a little ramp that goes down to the living room here. Wood burning fireplace. Saltillo tile that leads upstairs. Kitchen, this is the door right off the porch where we just were. Little dining area, kitchen. This is our mechanical room in here. So we've got a boiler and a hot water heater. Both are driven by propane. Boiler's pretty old. So as far as your husband is concerned, um, it appears to me that they have NM Surf internet here. And um, that's a wireless broadband that uh, is typically maxes out at 80 meg. This is a powder room or three quarter bathroom. Got a shower here. Right off the kitchen. And it adjoins a guest bedroom downstairs. South facing windows. So you're gonna have some big solar gain here for sure. But that adobe is quite efficient. This is the hallway back to the front door. And you have a little hall closet right there. I skipped past the garage, so I'm gonna zip back around and then we'll go upstairs. So this is the garage right off the kitchen. One car garage, and it's not insulated. Um, it appears that the uh, the south facing wall is all adobe though. Um, and then this rest of it, the balance of it is framed in. I'm gonna go ahead and go upstairs here. The Saltillo tile. Heading up, it's nice and bright up here. Just looking down into the living room, looking out towards the Pecos. This is south. So we have one bedroom there and we have the master here. They almost have a Jack and Jill. Um, you've got hot water baseboard heat here. This carpet's a little, seen better days. This is the master. You could build a deck off of this roof here. You have a doorway. Um, it's a modified bitumen roof, which is a good roof structure in the land of dumb roofs that are flat. Fantastic view to the northeast there. That's all Pecos Wilderness. There's 
your master closet. Walk in. And then you have a Jack and Jill master bath that adjoins the other room. Again, with the south facing window. Nice rough sawn timbers. The stucco has seen better days for sure. You can see out here, I'll zoom in. Uh, a lot of the parapets are cracked. Um, and stucco is going to crack. You know, it's cementious in nature, but it needs to be repaired. Um, you'll see this parapet here. Oh, a little hard with the screen. Let me zoom out. You can just see the change in the color. So that stucco is all peeling off. Um, or cracking off. It's cementious. It's not a synthetic stucco. Oop, let's go back out this way so you can get that perspective. This is the top hallway again. Only at six minutes, so I'm gonna keep on going. We're gonna explore the property a little bit. See what we can figure out with the barn. Long driveway coming in. Comes in through the east here. I just came right down that driveway there. like this is a pathway out here. Uh, the terrain definitely is not suitable for an arena. I'm not sure where, where we will see one, if we will see one. As I mentioned to you, some people's idea of an arena is not the same as you and I. idea of an arena or a barn is that you are going to put an arena or barn in. So real mature pinyons through here, pinyons and junipers, you're not really high enough for the ponderosa pines. Um, wow, there's some cool space out here. Really pretty. enough room you could definitely do something up here and it really drops off to the north here you can kind of see the drop off it's beautiful So you're about um, 30 minutes from the plaza here. Um, so you head north on I-25 from Santa Fe to um, <clears throat> 84, 285, 285 south. And you exit there and then you just take the frontage road, Old Santa Fe Trail, over to Apache Ridge Trail. And um, so, Honestly, it's not that far, but that dirt road takes a little while. But it wasn't too washboardy. It's not bad. Um, I sold a property up here probably three or four years ago. That's, oh, as the crow flies, maybe two houses that direction. Um, it had a great barn uh, that had been converted into an art studio. So it was like a six stall barn that had been converted. So they definitely have some mule deer up here and some turkey, Miriam's. 
then on the west side of the house here, just after I walk past my car, you'll see there's a, um, a shed to the right. And the propane tank is out by it. Unfortunately, propane is a little bit expensive here. And I think I may have found the barn. So we've got a big shed there. Appears to be a tough shed. Yep, we have discovered the barn. So it's on the east side of the property, east of the house. Again, I told you what to expect, what people think is a barn. So we've got um, shed row here. Uh, appears to be three, could be three 12 by 12 shed rows. There are actually more 10 by 10. Three 10 by 10 shed rows here. Um, they're on a permanent foundation. Definitely needs a little work. And here you go. Exactly what I suspected. This is <laughs> an arena. So um, it's really more of a turnout. Electric fence turnout. And... Uh, yeah, solar powered electric fence turnout. Okay, that's two ninety nine Apache, and um, I've not built a search engine for you yet, uh, but um, I'm going to. And and uh, when you see something that trips your trigger, let me know. Happy to come check it out for you and your husband. If I can't, I'll send one of my team members to do a much better virtual tour. Um, it's one of my weak points. So, this is the east side of the main house. And, uh, as always, call me with any questions. Thanks, Tracy. It was good talking to you yesterday. Crazy what a small world it is. Um, hope this gives you a better perspective. Have a good day.